We're in Lakewood. We're at our friend's shop at Snaps. So we all know Judd loves a chicken sandwich. So let's make Judd a chicken sandwich. We'll toast on the planche. One, two, three, in the pastrami fat. We're gonna start with some cornflake strips. We're gonna deep fry, these are chicken cunt to strip. They're breaded, flour, cornflake. It's an extra kind of crunch. We're gonna fry this for a little bit. We're gonna pull it out. We're gonna let it rest for about five minutes and then we're gonna fry it again. Chicken sandwiches for John need to be spicy, need to be a little bit sweet. So I took a little mixture of uh, sesame, some sugar, some oil, some chili flake, a little bit of Frank's Red Hot, and we're just gonna do kind of like a bang bangy kind of sweet asian -y sauce. A little bit of heat, a little bit of sweet, you know, make sure we dredge those. Judd hates ketchup, but I think pickles are necessary. We're gonna sneak in a little slaw, a little bit of their bang bang sauce, a little bit of crispy bacon, chicken, The smush is always important to me because then I do this. Judd, don't say I don't love you because I don't just make chickens for everybody. I make chicken sandwiches for you. Ah, Judd, I skipped the tomatoes. I skipped the ketchup. White meat juicy, crispy on the outside, nice bun. Today we are at a place that we happen to just love. Snaps Lakewood, Westgate Plaza, Brick Township, New Jersey. Are we in Brick? <laughs> this place is, is part of that restaurant idea, especially for Lakewood, where it's gotta be family dining, it's gotta be Bucker, young college student tea, yeshiva kid dining. It's gotta be somewhat affordable, budget conscious dining. That brings us to Snaps. Today, we're, it's all about the l'chaim of it all. There you go. There you go, the l'chaim of it all. Sesame chicken. Broccoli's for you. Oh you no, 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 that's for you. He has his chicken basically marinating almost in a cornstarch slurry. And it really gives it like this beautiful creamy, but stick to the sauce. The heat is very important here too, because it's spicier than your Jewish regs. Yeah, not too crazy. But not too crazy? That's right. The texture's perfect. There's a definitive line between Jewish delis and kosher delis. One of those definitive lines used to be something called a Reuben, which is Swiss, corned beef, pastrami, and kraut, and griddle. The Reuben here has other things. They put a rosy garlic ruffle mayo to kind of give you that creamy, but it's all about that fatty pastrami and that crusty bread. Oh man. Yes. It's the right kind of sal salty, fatty pastrami. You got your bacony, your salty, your funky, your crunchy. That's a satisfying sound. I grew up with tater tots. The, the Minnesota dish is something called hot dish, and it is, it is made with tater tots. I'm a tater tot gangster, right? And to have them just dipped in, Franks with crunchy pastrami mm. does not even, does not really need us to explain it. My grandmother makes something and my grandfather says, Meh, it's good. And I always got upset and I said, what do you mean it's good? It's excellent, it's great. When I mean good, I mean great. So a good chicken sandwich is an elevated chicken sandwich. A good chicken sandwich is something special. Tomato, pickle, sauce, crunchy chicken, bun, lettuce. That's a, that's a perfect chicken sandwich. Great sauce. <laughs> Udon noodles are a thick, chewy Japanese noodle. They're also the version of this guy named Yassi W, whose whole job is to explore kosher and explore further than kosher. Snaps is the spot that he does that in. This is his playground, this is his lab. He has a brisket udon, he's got a broth, he's mixing some culture, but he's got Asian noodly beefy down. Lakewood, you're getting pretty darn multicultural. This is Snaps, Lakewood New Jersey.